What can you say? During the last decades, the whole of Acholi land was just like a jungle because people were in the camps that were dotted along trading centers and along some roads. The rural land was abandoned to animals and the rebels and the government soldiers. When we started the campaign for peace, we named threats to land. And that's why in the Juba Peace Agreement, there is a provision that is dedicated to land. And I want to put it on record that in our dealings with the government, we should focus on the Juba Peace Agreement, not the NRM Manifesto. The NRM Manifesto is for winning elections. But what really touches our real problems are in the Juba Peace Agreement. Mm -hmm. From that moment, we took a position which I want to declare that it was wrong for anybody to start acquiring land when people were in IDP camps. Therefore, we must advocate for the cancellation of titles which were acquired when people were in IDP camps. This is a reasonable demand. Investors must deal with the people, not the state or state agents.